What is up YouTube? We're back with another YouTube video and today we're going to be going over how to complete the missile transports tier 2 shadow company mission. You can see it says we traced that Coney ship back to Europe where it was reported that 8 shipping containers made it onto that deck yet only 6 are currently spotted. Now with 2 missile launchers out in the wild for Coney to use, well that just doesn't sound right does it? Here's what you're going to help to do about it. We believe those launchers are somewhere in Almazra. We need you to find where they're planning on moving the missiles to and plant beacons on them for us to surveil. Lay low out there. Now your first task is to locate the remaining missiles using the transportation plans from the Kony ship in one deployment. Then your second task is to take the two IR beacons from the Zaya Observatory dead drop and plant one near the first missile. And then your third task is to plant one IR beacon at the second missile. So now we're going to get in game and show you guys how you can get this done. Now that we're in game, I'm going to show you the location of where you got to go first. Now here I would recommend just going straight for the ship over here by Albagra Fortress. Here you can see this is me kind of showing you guys where you have to go. It's towards the right of Albagra and it's right underneath the airport. And it's this big cargo ship that was added with the new update. But when you get over here, just know that's where you have to go. But when you get towards it, this is where you're going to want to get off. And there's going to be zip lines here that you can follow. I'm going to just show you the path straight up that way uh, you can't get lost or anything. But it is a pretty easy ship to navigate. It's not anything too complicated. But there is going to be AI here, so watch out. Now you can see we're going to run in and then go straight forward here. Go up those stairs. Work your way now towards the back of this ship. And then take these stairs up. And then, again, there's going to be AI everywhere. And then go up. And then here is where you're going to want to take the missile transportation plans. Stow that in your inventory. And then after you stow it, make sure you open your inventory and you read whatever it says. Here it says we don't have much resources to move each uh, container at once. Let's send the first one to the cemetery and we'll have to figure the rest out after. Now for me, the key takeaway there is cemetery. Now I've done this with several teams and in some instances cemetery is the same spot every time i don't know if cemetery can be a different spot at first but read it and whatever it says that's where you're going to want it to go but before you go there go to zaya observatory and pick up the dead drop so here you can see i showed the location but i'm going to show it one more time here after i cleared the area out of ai but here you can see i'm going to open the dead drop and you're going to have ir beacons now please make sure you have two empty slots in your inventory before you pick them up you can see here i had three just to be safe and then I opened it. As you can see, it shows one IR beacon, but it's going to put two in your inventory. So just be very careful with that. The first time I did this, I went to pick up the IR beacon with only one slot in my inventory. And it only put one in, and it didn't drop the IR beacon on the floor. So I was stuck with only one, so I had to restart and do it all over again. But after you pick up the two IR beacons, now you can make your way to the cemetery or whatever your first location said in the missile transportation notes. So now I'm going to cut over to me getting to the cemetery. Here you can see we've entered the cemetery. And pretty much all you want to look for is a big red cargo container that's open. That is like an empty housing area for a missile. You can see right here I'm approaching it and it's this big red cargo crate. Really can't miss it. And you can see as I approach the area the AI are going to start shooting at me. So I cleared them out real quick. And once you run up here you are going to get prompted to place your IR beacon. So you can see right here, place the IR beacon. You get that prompt. Whatever your interact button is, you can do that and it'll place it on the ground. Now there's gonna be a note. Read that note and it says, after your first missile in the cemetery, take the second into the hydroelectric district somewhere with good aerial access near a road. Perhaps one in the gas station would do. Now, this is the one where I've seen different locations. I've seen one other location, which has been by Said City by the football arena i think is what they call it and that's one potential spot for me this was the first time i saw that it was hydroelectric so just know that this one you might have a different location from mine but your main takeaway is to just look at the name or whatever it says there you can see mine said hydroelectric i came over here i found the cargo container by the gas station and i placed it and i got mission complete so hopefully if you found that useful make sure to like comment subscribe Jump so a follow on my Twitch, twitch.tv forward slash monkeysham0. Ring the bell so you don't miss another video. A playlist with all my DMZ guys will be popping up right now. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.